Okay, there we go. Okie dokie, and welcome back. After hard, hard and trying work. As you can see, I'm almost dead. Um, we're gonna try and repair this elevator. Oh yeah, man, you got it. <laughs> Take it, it's yours. Nice. Chamber three repaired. Oh yeah. I'm not gonna make that noise again. <laughs> um, just there. Actually, I don't have enough. She has like a heart locket for 46. Oh, this is there we go. <laughs> it's just so close to death. Uh, let's use the heart shotgun. Where are you? There you are. <laughs> nice. Good job. I don't think I'm going to be able to finish the boss fight in Chamber 3. Mm, offering. That's it. I'm not sure what that one is. I'm assuming blanks? Oh. get that heart locket. It's probably cursed. I think all of her items are cursed, but she sells things at a slight discount. She also has an elder blank, but again, I don't have enough. So, let's get that heart locket. Oh, uh, yeah. Alright. I have no idea what the consequence is. Oh, I ran into a glitched chest. Um, if you see it, don't open it right away. It's intentional. It's not like it's not. It's glitched on purpose. It takes you to chamber two, and then you fight. Uh, in my case, I fought. I tried to fight two beholsters. Um. I'm not sure if it will appear on any floor outside of chamber one. I wish I kind of recorded it, but you know, I didn't. So. Oh, not good. Hold on. There we go. Got the ringing in the ears going on. There we go. <laughs> Death by teddy bear. Ooh, explosive decoy. 
But yeah, um, it's a very, it was a very strange encounter. You'll know it when you see it. It's it looks like a normal chest, except it's got some strange coding errors and things exploded. Strange. Probably save me from the boss fight. Okay, so we're gonna do this. Do we have any more rooms to explore? I'm not really. Do I have any keys? I don't have any keys. Um, I could buy a blank. Yeah, let's go buy a blank. Why not? We'll pull on the right one. Or, how about a heart? How much is that? 42. Well, ah, uh, 28, what? Oh, that's right, the pilot makes it cheaper for like 20. I forgot. Okay, let's, uh, let's go ahead and get this death part on the road. Back to the breach. Just do the pilot. Why not? Do, do, do. Let's see if the shop has anything new. Oh yeah, these guys. Um, just real quick, this guy right here. Uh, if you encounter him in any chamber, he will offer you a challenge. Uh, to complete a room, he'll like, he create, I don't think he creates a room, but the room is, you know, created as part of the mapping if he's there on the chamber floor. He'll challenge you to go to this room that he designates, and he will give you, um, like, you can't dodge, or take any hits, stuff like that. So, uh, he gives you money. So, if you see him and you get the key, I guess it's not a bad... Oop. Okay. Let's head out. The respawn. It's... I mean, it's okay. Um... What is it? I also unlocked a Link, essentially, from the Zelda games. I don't know why I'm explaining that. Everyone knows who Link is. Uh, if you find him, he's... He's usually in, like, this big fancy looking room on the chamber floor he's just kind of wandering around with a map and he doesn't know where he's going and he's confused and he'll ask you to map out the, uh, the chamber so essentially complete like exploring every room and then going back to him he'll give you 11 so um what else have I unlocked anything else oh that guy I don't know what that guy does uh this guy up here I 
have no idea. I think... Yeah, I don't know. If you can accidentally knock over his helmet and you can encounter him again in the dungeon, he doesn't actually do anything. At least, I don't know if he does anything. So, I'm just gonna say that he doesn't until I see otherwise. He might be like in the later chamber floors, like maybe chamber 5, which I haven't gotten to yet. Nice. Turn your eyes on the beholster. Kill the beholster three times. Okay. Uh, this guy. Yeah. He's alright. I guess. Of course we all know who he is. Let's go straight to three. Let's do it. Buy him. Let's see. Whoa. What? <laughs> Should I? <laughs> Should I? <laughs> it was probably a bad idea. Let's do it. Oh. Health and gum is probably, but I don't know what the tear trigger does. I've seen it, I just haven't actually chance to buy it yet, so... Okay, there we go. Lockpicks. have to look at the footage when I go to edit this, but I have a feeling I didn't take a hit. I could be wrong. Okay. There we go. Got it. Oh, gotta reload. And come on. There we go. I guess the only downside to taking the shortcut is these forms is not being able to try and get the uh, Mastercraft, which gives you another health. Probably stop using all my ammo. Maybe. So I think, yeah, let's, um, let's go ahead and not die, that would be great. Let's take care of this, um, where is he? He's here somewhere. There he is. Got him. Oh. Also another disadvantage, <laughs> of course, of uh, taking these floors uh, instead of just going from chamber one and on and going up, or I guess down. Actually. Um, you don't get the money, you don't get the keys. Uh, 
I'm not doing well. Oh my. Come back for that health. Side. I forgot. Um, come back. Voila! That's semi. Alright. Let's head to the other side. <laughs> My armor! <laughs> Man. 
forgot how big Chamber 3 is. for your amusement. Oh, they took damage. Okay. All right. Oh, armor. And we have enough. I feel like I should get a key. Come on, lock pick. Don't fail me now. Never mind. <laughs> Damn you, luck. Okay, there we go. And. Never mind. Can't go as far. I believe is the boss room. Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna be the boss room. What? Oh. Well, it's good to know that now. try and keep up with them. otherwise this is just gonna take forever. Come on! Okay, that was my bad. This might be it. I don't know if I can.
Oh. Well. <laughs> he looks so sad, but he's dead. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, with that, <laughs> gonna have to try better next time. I'll see you in the next one.